Garrett. Hello, Mary Beth. Oh, how are you, Arthur? Fine. How are you? Um, well, I'm well, I think. It's been quite a run we've had, but, but we're still alive. So, no regrets? Regrets for what? Oh, for joining this band of maniacs. If you're a girl without means in this world, life is very scary. You boys care for me before no one cared for me. Well, life weren't very nice, Arthur. Not after Mama got typhoid, and that was a long time ago. All right, head for Rhodes, and quick! She's in Rhodes? No, she's at a place called Bradley's house, just west of there. How do you know? When we first got here, she told me she was worried that our camp was near a safe house that gang she ran with used from time to time. And you told Dutch? No. She spoke to me in confidence. I suppose I didn't think it would be a problem. Now it is. Oh, yes. I'll deal with them. What you want? Kind sir, we're lost and in need of some help. Don't get out of here! Oh, I see that kindly face of yours. And I know that for the right inducements. Now get out of here. Oh, now you keep saying that. You don't mean nothing by well, I it. I said. You said your last word. Well, what are you waiting for? Get in there and find our girl. <laughs> Okay, now right, let's go. Oh, come along, miss. Thank you, both of you. What happened? It was Anthony Foreman. He thinks he owns me. I remember. Where is he? He went out hunting or something. There were five of them, I think. Well, we killed those fellas there. There they are. Come on. Tilly, grab that gun. Anyone approaches, shoot them. Oh, don't worry. I'll be just fine. Now catch that uh, bastard. Uh, <laughs> There, straight ahead. I saw him go through those bushes. Oh, look at Let's finish these scum. They're heading down the hill. You've got it. And there they are by the shoreline.
With pleasure. This could get bumpy. Do you have the first idea what you're getting into? Oh, oh man. Uh, what the hell? Do you have the first idea what you're getting into? I'm Anthony Foreman. Well, thanks for the introduction, Anthony. Is that Foreman with an A? I want the undertaker to spell it right. Funny bastard. Coward. Funny bastard. <laughs> Who are you running with? She didn't tell you? She didn't tell me nothing. <laughs> this rope is cutting it. All right. Here's your man. Bring him here. Dump him on the ground here. I want to get a good look at this monster. So he's still alive then? Ah. Yes. You see this girl? You leave her alone. She killed my cousin. Your goddamn cousin had it coming, Anthony Foreman. I don't care if she shot your daddy and cooked your mama for breakfast. She's mine. She ate yours. You know, a friend of mine, he always says, <clears throat> revenge is a fool's game. Now, you want all your boys dead? She had her reasons. We was family, Tilly Jackson. You Foreman boys ain't no kind of family I want. Kill him, Arthur! You want that? I want him to go away and tell the remaining of his cousins and the clowns he rides with to leave me alone! Now, you think you can do that, Anthony? Or should I slit your throat and just save us all the bother? I'll leave you alone. History is done. History is never done. It's your call, Arthur. But I'd slit his throat. Go on. Finish the bastard off. You know my... Sadly, I agree with you. <laughs> Sorry, partner. We can't take no chances with the likes of you. Yeah. <laughs> 